Welcome back to another video and today I'll be showcasing my one system as well as like XP and uh, mana and as you can see on the on the hop bar you see my player name level how much XP I got and uh, my mana which is MP and uh, I have created three ones and don't mind the the destruction around here but you might recognize this uh, this world from a previous video of mine where I showcased the uh, uh, a spell system and please make please please go to my channel and check that video out but this is just basically the more in-depth version of uh, of the spell this is with mana the previous one wasn't and this has more spells as well so firstly we can start with a fireball one which is quite simple if we crouch as you can see it will go come with a bar underneath the hot bar where it says spell and now this is ready and when this is ready you can uncrouch and activate it like that as you can see, you get it down. Right? So this is pretty nice. It costs uh, 25 mana. And if you don't have enough, you can't activate it. So if I use this enough times, I won't be able to activate it because I have insufficient mana. So let me activate it a few times. Oh, one more time. There you go. And now... I failed that. I didn't <laughs> activate it too quickly. There you go. It says insufficient mana. Now that I have to over 25, it will work. So watch. I don't know why the sound is bugged. Oh, that was kind of weird. But that was the fireball one. We also have two others. Inclined Freeze, which is my personal favorite. This one has a little bit longer charging time or casting time. And then when you activate it... Oh, I activated it too early I gotta wait a little bit this one actually costs 50 mana so I right now I'd actually but if we so basically how this one works is it activates when it hits sur uh, surface or when it hits a, an entity so right now as you can see the cool particles activate it boom this is perfect like uh, this has a good like projectile system so I can shoot up here I can aim wherever I want and it will actually hit uh, where I'm aiming so if I try again uh, I need more mana. Wait, I can do it with scoreboard, so it's quite easier. Uh, slash scoreboard. Players uh, set as mana 100. Boom, and then if I put it here, as you can see, that's pretty nice. Hit just like exactly where I actually aimed it. And uh, to actually showcase, what's the, uh, showcase what this thing does is uh, summon a pig. Slash summon a pig like this. And then we can just aim at this pig right here, casting the spell. This one takes quite a lot of time to charge, because it's quite good. But if I, oh, hit it, as you can see, it will slow it down, as well as do, like, frost damage. Like, the quite a lot of damage, as you can see. And I walk in, I have slowness and all that. Let me go out, because it's quite loud. But, that's basically it. The, the free spell, which is a quite, the, I, I really like the projectile system on this. And it works very well. Like I can snipe that thing over there. Like perfectly with no problem at all. <laughs> Look at that. And then we have uh, the final thing, which is a quicksand. This one's kind of more like an area or crowd control ability or uh, uh, magic. But basically, when I uncrouch, this is quicksand. I can walk on it fine. But if I get something like a pig or something. Uh, it could be any mobs, I'm just saying pigs, because why not, like... But anyways, it will actually sink down into the ground. It will suffocate them. This this will disappear within uh, 20 seconds, and it will actually copy... Like, it will be the exact same uh, ground, which will be copied back. But yeah, that's the quicksand. That's quite a cool particle for the casting. This is the... And boom. This is basically all the spells. So just to showcase them all once again, I'm going to give myself like extra mana as well, so I could use them like rapidly. 200. So first of all, we got the fireball spell. Boom, that's that one. And then we have the inclined freeze uh, spell. Just boom, that's that one. And the final one is uh, quicksand, which is quite nice. Bada boom. And all these cost mana, if you don't have enough mana to use them, you can, it says insufficient mana. 
which is quite nice. Uh, I, I, it works very well, in my opinion. And you can have infinite more more ones. This is just three I've made up. And uh, if you were wondering, I said in the beginning of the video, like, this, don't mind the destruction. The reason why there's so much destruction is uh, some of my friends uh, of mine actually uh, did some fighting with the ones, and it's quite destructive, as you can see. But this is quite cool, it takes mana. And I also made like a level up system, so if I give myself some XP, slash uh, scoreboard players add as, uh, as uh, the XP. And if I add like 50 for example, as you can see it will increase, and if I add it all the way until it reaches the cap, the maximum, you leveled up, and I did indeed level up. If I level up one more time it should be 213, so let's see, 213. And that's basically the level up system, I, you can also make it so... I haven't made this yet, but you can quite easily make it interact with uh, when you kill mobs, you actually gain experience, it's quite easy to do. And with that you can also add stuff like stats, you get more strength or something when you level up higher. You can maybe add more space for your mana, so you have more mana space, maybe even the activation or like the mana regeneration might be higher. There's so many, like there's limited, limitless uh, possibilities for this. And it's just very quite nice. You can add a lot of those of items. You can also add other custom items like like a ring or something that regenerates mana faster, like in relic or something. So yeah. And that's it for the video. I'll see you guys later. Peace.